For the second time in less than a month, someone stole an important piece of equipment, field equipment specifically, from a West Side Little League. The Argyle Athletic Association says someone broke into the field's storage container and stole the tractor used to plow the field. Another plow was stolen from the Normandy Athletic Association in late June. News for Jack's reporter Maggie Lorenz covered both stories. Maggie, this is surprising that it has happened twice. It really is, Janice. I talked to the president of Argyle Athletic Association here, and he says due to the similarities, he thinks that someone is targeting these little leagues. Take a look here. I want to show you. This is the storage container where he says that the tractor was stolen. He says that the thief didn't even have to break the lock. They just busted open these hinges because this storage container, it's falling apart. This is what the tractor looks like. It's a John Deere Gator, and it's what makes the field smooth and safe to play. The association is now out $3,000, and they don't have the funds lying around to replace it. In the meantime, they're having to move practices to Argyle's other field that's miles away. The president of the association, Jeffrey Eads, has this message for whoever is stealing this field equipment. Unfortunately, uh, I I'm very sad. Uh, you know, obviously it affects the kids. Um, you know, I'm just a volunteer just like anybody else. It affects the kids, so it's more about the kids for me. It's taking away from the kids. When you rob from an, an, any athletic association like us, you're robbing from the kids. Association is now working with the city of Jacksonville to come up with a more secure solution. Eve says that Councilman Randy White told him that he would help partially fund construction of a new building that would replace these aging storage containers. And in some positive news, looking out for their fellow league, the Argyle Athletic Association says that they're going to donate an old field plow they had lying around to the Normandy Athletic Association, who had to stop hosting practices and games there when their field plow was stolen a few weeks ago. Live on the West Side, Maggie Lorenz, Channel 4, the local station.